Was the most famous dress in American history damaged after Kim Kardashian wore it? Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 most controversial reality TV stars ever. It's the walk of shame. I'm not going to do it. For this list, we'll be looking at the most notable celebrities who rose to fame on unscripted television series and have made headlines for all the wrong reasons. Who is your favorite or least favorite controversial reality TV star? Let us know in the comments. Number 10. Abby Lee Miller Some people aren't necessarily well-equipped to work with kids, and Abby Lee Miller is a prime example of that. She expected perfection from her students on Dance Moms and was willing to do anything to reach that level, from grueling rehearsals to verbal mistreatment. Well, if you yell at me, I'm gonna cry. Get out! Go! Go. She would even sometimes treat the kids based on how she felt about their moms. At one point, she even went so far as to not address someone by their name. Yo, Blondie, you were gone for a week, not a year. As if that weren't enough, Miller has also gone through several financial and legal fiascos, and even served time for fraud in 2017. Since her release from prison, she has largely stepped away from the spotlight. Because even if you're gone, the show must go on. Number 9. Tiffany Pollard Tiffany New York Pollard is one of the most recognizable reality stars of this generation, and for good reason. No matter what show she appears on, she's always the center of attention and produces memes that are remembered for years. Which wall? Yeah. Pick a wall! Yeah. Pick a wall. However, with that fame comes plenty of notoriety. During Flavor of Love, she was constantly picking verbal fights and even got into a physical altercation near the end of season one. Beyonce, sweetie, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry that a ugly ass bitch like this would even say that. She has also been criticized and accused of transphobia throughout the years. She's incredibly divisive as a reality star. While her behavior made for dramatic TV, many found her to be too much. And also, don't ever call me a Number 8. Johnny Fairplay Some people are willing to do anything to win a reality TV show, and Johnny Fairplay came very close with his bizarre approach on Survivor. In an attempt to get as far as possible in the competition, Fairplay and a pal decided to tell the cast that his grandmother had passed away during filming. They even used the shock of the moment as a way to snag a challenge win. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. Of course. Of course. Fans were upset for him at first, but that all changed when it was revealed that his grandmother was fine the entire time. This news shocked the contestants, who found out later, the audience, and even host Jeff Probst. Happy that my grandma's at home and doing just fine. Number 7. Teresa Judice. Teresa Judice never had the best reputation. Even on The Real Housewives of New Jersey, she was known for constantly starting fights and causing scenes. As extreme as that behavior was, it was par for the course for the franchise, and fans weren't too shocked by it. However, what did shock them was when she and her now ex-husband Joe were charged with several financial crimes in 2013. She received a 15-month jail sentence, but was released months early. He served even more time and was deported, and the pair ultimately split. Despite her legal issues, Judice has remained a staple on The Real Housewives, where she provides audiences with plenty of drama. Some things never change. You're the one who put it out there! Are you kidding me? Let's You're a dinner. Let's sick, disgusting liar. <laughs> Number 6. Omarosa Manigault Newman While Omarosa may have gotten her start as a villain while on The Apprentice, she's now known more for her involvement in politics. Years after her appearance on the show, she was hired by Donald Trump to work for his campaign, despite having claimed to be a Democrat. I have never seen Donald Trump act inappropriately with women. He's always been very respectful. Their relationship didn't end there, though. She worked for him after he was elected, and even referred to herself as a Trumplican. Despite this, she was let go by John Kelly, then chief of staff, in 2017. So that Manigault was physically dragged and escorted off the campus. After this, she started lambasting Trump, even publishing a novel titled Unhinged, wherein she described how racist he was. 
Her conflicting actions had many confused, and many saw her attempts at playing both sides to be ridiculous. Yeah, but Donald Trump is his worst enemy. Number five, Cody Brown. Polygamy is illegal in the United States, so when Sister Wives started airing, viewers everywhere were stunned that the family was being so open about their relationship. Oh my Ever. goodness. You For 10 to years back. then. That was the problem. The problem was just that you never got over that. Although the show was initially successful, there was also a fair amount of backlash, especially towards the patriarch Cody Brown. He's been criticized for multiple reasons, particularly for the way he treats his spouses and children. Man up and, and take some accountability and some responsibility. The peak of his controversy occurred when he and partners attempted to overturn polygamy laws in Utah in 2013 after they were nearly indicted for their relationship. While they didn't win in the end, the case received nationwide attention. As of 2022, the family unit appears to be struggling, with one of the wives, Christine, having left. I feel strongly this is the best choice for me. Number four, Will Kirby. One unique aspect of reality TV is that audiences love to root for the bad guy. That was definitely the case with Big Brother's Will Kirby. Normally having two brain cells is enough to survive in life, but eventually Howie's brain cells start arguing with each other. Now, we've all heard of manipulative or rude contestants, but Kirby took things to the next level. He was nicknamed Dr. Evil after all. In his first season, he insulted other players to their faces. On an all-star season of the show, he begged to be sent home so that he wouldn't have to be around the other house members any longer. I can't find an individual to hate, because I hate you all. He even threatened to lose on purpose if they didn't comply. Despite all of this controversy, he's considered to be among the best players to have been on Big Brother, winning his original season. On that note, I bid you a fond farewell, and I look forward to seeing you all very soon. Number three, Janelle Evans. 16 and Pregnant and its Teen Mom spinoffs weren't exactly meant to follow people who had gotten parenting down to a science. Give me back my credit card. I don't have your credit card, you Mom. Used but the level of controversy that followed Janelle Evans around was next level. From the beginning of her son's life, people accused her of neglecting him to party. Things didn't exactly improve as she got older either. She's been arrested numerous times and was once involved in a violent road rage incident while her child was in the passenger seat. You were tailgating me, you dumbass! Fans of the show often called out her behavior, believing that she was endangering her kids' lives. Her partner, David Eason, who killed their dog and reportedly mistreated her and their children, has gotten plenty of negative press as well. It was a situation where, you know, my my daughter, her, her health, her safety was in danger. Number two, Tila Tequila. Tila Tequila's time on TV may have been relatively short, but her controversies live on. Though she had a promising entertainment career in the 2000s, that ended in 2013, when she published a disturbing article about her support for Adolf Hitler. She even posted a picture of herself posing in front of Auschwitz while dressed as a Nazi. Any support for the star plummeted, and her Facebook account was shut down. This incident also caused her to be booted from Celebrity Big Brother in 2015. When her views were brought to our attention, she was called to the diary room for a discussion with producers and was subsequently removed from the house. She then continued to double down with racist remarks and actions, which resulted in a Twitter suspension. She has attempted to rebrand using another name, but her horrible reputation rightfully continues to follow her. But at the same time, I just felt like self-destructing. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number one, Kim Kardashian. When people think of controversial reality stars, Kim Kardashian is usually the first one that comes to mind. Her whole career has been based on controversy since the very start, even since her infamous tape was leaked. From the allegations of cultural appropriation, to her attempt to break the internet, to wearing Marilyn Monroe's dress, she always finds a way to make the news. Taken before and after Kim wore it, appear to show stretched fabric and missing beads. One notable scandal involved her making out-of-touch comments about work culture. Get your up and work. 
It seems like nobody wants to work these days. Many felt her statements weren't fair or accurate by any means, especially given her privilege. Despite all of this, people can't help but tune into her shows to see what outlandish things she says or does next. That was taken out of context, but I'm, I'm really sorry if it was received that way. Did you enjoy this video? Check out these other clips from WatchMojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.